Nate Diaz, and Gilbert Dorino Burns. You ready? Uh, you ready? All right, so here we go. Round one is underway. I can't wait to see how this fight plays out because he told us on Thursday that despite his opponent's submission acumen, he's more than willing to engage him on the ground. A lot of times guys fight with their ego. They try to go and fight their opponent in their spots. Let's see if this proves to be a very bad decision. Nice punch by Burns. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Oh, really using his reach advantage as he landed the jab there. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Burns. Bleeding over the left eye now. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Diaz gets caught with that punch. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. Over and over, he landed a big body kick. Oh, look at him land another jab there. He's certainly using that weapon effectively here tonight. The most effective weapon in all of boxing, in all of combat sports, is a jab. This young man has a knowledge of using it like no one else. Kick to the body by Burns. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. So just over 20 total strikes have landed for Nate Diaz. Oh, that right hand is on point. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. Just out of the range with that right hand. Ninety seconds to go. He is all about that left kick to the body. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Just missed with the left there. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. And he landed the right hand there. All right, so a good job by him here. He continues to block these shots. Seems to see them coming a mile away. He sees them coming a mile away, and he's blocking, he's rolling, he's slipping. He's doing a great job. Powerful leg kick land. Nice kick. Oh. Final seconds of round one. What a round. All right, now we take a look back at some. All right, second round now underway. I'm no analyst, but a little bit of a feeling out process there in round one. And that's a part of being in the octagon with someone that's so skilled. You cannot just go after them guns of blazing. Both of these young men are trying to find the right moment to attack. Good punch lands. Right hook to the head, blocked. Man, that cut is only getting worse. Canvas cleanup guy's gonna be busy. Well, you saw the tail of the tape. He has a reach advantage and made good use of it there with that punch. Oh, beautiful jab from Nate Diaz. If he gets that weapon going early, could be trouble. Yeah, he starts touching me with the jab over and over again. And then when he starts to let that right hand fly, you start to see real big reactions from his opponent. Well, it's not due to a lack of effort. He continues to throw, but this is like double A striking. This is not high level. Yeah, you can't. Oh, that was a big takedown. Is this the one that's going to break you? Close guard. Just over three minutes to go in round two. Back to the feet now. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. 
Oh, here comes the kick. That one blocked by Diaz. Burns gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Telegraph that spinning back fist. Just misses with a left hook there. Oh! He's oh! He's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Looks like he's going after the leg. We'll see if he can get the submission. Oh! Oh, we're getting a finish here. It's in there deep. There you go. And there's the tap of a violent one at that, and you get a false sense of security messing around with this guy on the ground. He's got submissions from everywhere. Goes to the heel hook well to Beautiful finish by this jiu-jitsu ace. He went right from the top position into that heel hook and got the finish. All right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. I mean, you know this guy has such a great submission game that you cannot lay in his guard. He's so skilled. He's so tricky and he's so good at weaving a web that gets you lost in it that he made him pay for it. The official decision is in. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen. Goodness gracious, move like the Gracie brothers. Your name's Sutton. Fed everybody that